In electromagnetism, Jefomenko's equations named after Oleg D. Jefomenko give the electric field and magnetic field due to a distribution of electric charges and electric current in space, that takes into account the propagation delay retarded time of the fields due to the finite speed of light and relativistic effects. Therefore they can be used for moving charges and currents. They are the general solutions to Maxwell's equations for any arbitrary distribution of charges and currents. Topic: Equations. Topic: Electric and magnetic fields. Jefomenko's equations give the E field and B field produced by an arbitrary charge or current distribution of charge density ρ and current density J. E R T equals 1 4 pi e0 rho r t r r minus r 3 plus 1 r minus r 2 c rho R T R T R minus R minus one R minus R C two J R T R T D Three R Display style Math BF E Math BF R T equals frac one four pi epsilon underscore zero int left left frac row Math BF R T underscore R Math BF R Math BF R carrot three plus frac one Math BF R Math BF R carrot two C frac partial row Math BF R T underscore R partial T right Math BF R Math BF R frac one Math BF R Math BF R C carrot two frac partial math BF J math BF R T underscore R partial T right mathram D carrot three math BF R B R T equals mu zero four pi J R T R R minus R three plus one R minus R two C J R T R T times R minus R D three R Display style Math BF B Math BF R T equals frac mu underscore zero four pi int left frac Math BF J Math BF R T underscore R Math BF R Math BF R carrot three plus frac one Math BF R Math BF R carrot two C frac partial Math BF J Math BF R T underscore R partial T right times left Math BF R Math BF R right Mathram D carrot three Math BF R, where R is a point in the charge distribution, R is a point in space, and T R equals T minus R minus R C. Display style T underscore R equals T frac Math BF R Math BF R C is the retarded time. There are similar expressions for D and H. These equations are the time-dependent generalization of Coulomb's law and the Biot-Savart law to electrodynamics, which were originally true only for electrostatic and magnetostatic fields, and steady currents. <laughs> <laughs> Origin from retarded potentials 
Jeffermenko's equations can be found from the retarded potentials phi and a phi r t equals one four pi e zero rho r t r r minus r d three r a r t equals mu zero four pi j r t r r minus r d three r Display style begin aligned and Vuffy Math BFR T equals DFRAC one four pi epsilon underscore zero int DFRAC row Math BFR T underscore R Math BFR Math BFR Mathram D carrot three Math BFR and Math BFA Math BFR T equals DFRAC mu underscore zero four pi int DFRAC Math BFJ Math BFR T underscore R Math BFR, Math BFR, Mathram D carrot three, Math BFR, end aligned, which are the solutions to Maxwell's equations in the potential formulation, then substituting in the definitions of the electromagnetic potentials themselves, E equals minus phi minus A T, B equals times a display style, Math BF E equals Nabla, Vafi, DFRAC, partial, Math BF a partial T, quad, Math BF B equals Nabla times Math BF a and using the relation C two equals one E zero mu zero display style C carrot two equals frac one epsilon underscore zero mu underscore zero replaces the potentials phi and a by the fields E and B. Topic Discussion There is a widespread interpretation of Maxwell's equations indicating that spatially varying electric and magnetic fields can cause each other to change in time, thus giving rise to a propagating electromagnetic wave electromagnetism. However, Jeffermenko's equations show an alternative point of view. Jeffermenko says, Neither Maxwell's equations nor their solutions indicate an existence of causal links between electric and magnetic fields. Therefore, we must conclude that an electromagnetic field is a dual entity always having an electric and a magnetic component simultaneously created by their common sources, time-variable electric charges and currents." As pointed out by MacDonald, Jeffermenko's equations seem to appear first in 1962 in the second edition of Panofsky and Phillips's classic textbook. David Griffiths, however, clarifies that the earliest explicit statement of which I am aware was by Oleg Jeffermenko, in 1966, and characterizes equations in Panofsky and Phillips's textbook as only closely related expressions. According to Andrew Zangwill, the equations analogous to Jeffermenko's but in the Fourier frequency domain were first derived by George Adolphus Schott in his treatise Electromagnetic Radiation, University Press, Cambridge, 1912. Essential features of these equations are easily observed which is that the right-hand sides involve retarded time which reflects the causality of the expressions. In other words, the left side of each equation is actually caused by the right side, unlike the normal differential expressions for Maxwell's equations where both sides take place simultaneously. In the typical expressions for Maxwell's equations there is no doubt that both sides are equal to each other, but as Jeffermenko notes, Since each of these equations connects quantities simultaneous in time, none of these equations can represent a causal relation. The second feature is that the expression for E does not depend upon B and vice versa. Hence, it is impossible for E and B fields to be creating each other. Charge density and current density are creating them both. Topic. See also: Lyapunov weakert potential. Topic notes. <laughs>